Hello everyone, welcome to Infigyan. In this very very exciting video of algebraic challenging equations, we'll be solving fourth root of 97 minus x plus fourth root of x equal to 5. While solving, we will use algebraic identities, manipulation, Pascal triangle, quadratic equation formula, and we'll conclude our result. So let's begin this problem by considering this term as a and this term as b. Once I will write a is equal to fourth root of x, b is equal to fourth root of 97 minus x, then we can conclude a power 4 is equal to x and from second equation b power 4 is equal to 97 minus x. If I will add both the equations, I will get one very interesting equation a power 4 plus b power 4 is equal to 97 and from original one it is a plus b equal to 5. So equation number 1 let me call this and we will call this equation number 2. Now see power is 4 so obviously I am going to write a plus b whole power 4 expansion. So the degree, the power of first term will be decreasing and second term would be increasing. Okay. Then we will talk about coefficients. So let me write it. A power 4 plus A power 3 B. A power 4 B power 0. A power 3 B power 1 plus A power 2 B power 2 plus a power 1, b power 3 and last term we will have b power 4. a power 0, b power 4. Now coefficient, how we will write using Pascal triangle. So let me write here Pascal triangle, how we can draw it. 1, 1. Now power 2, 1, 2, 1. Power 3, 1, 3, 3, 1. Power 4, which is our requirement. 4, 6, 4, 1. These are coefficients. So I am going to write 1 means 1, 4, 6, 4, 1. This is our expansion. Now only arranging, arranging it. Now I will arrange all the terms respectively a power 4 plus b power 4 first and last term. From second term and second last term I will take 4ab common. So what I will be left with a square plus b square plus 6a square b square. Okay. Left hand side is a plus b whole power 4. Now let's put the value. a plus b is 5. So I will write here 5 power 4. It is not 54, 5 power 4. Okay. a power 4 plus b power 4, 97 plus 4ab. Now the task is a square plus b square. Either we have to find out separately or we can use algebraic identity direct here and we can write here. So I can write a plus b whole square. Okay, done. What is extra? 2ab. So I, I have to counter it minus 2ab. But remaining term as it is. Put the value. 5 power 4 is 625. It is, let me write in this way, 5 power 4. Okay. 97 plus 4ab. a plus b square. So let me write 25. a plus b is 5 minus 2ab plus 6a square b square. Now I have to only arrange the terms. After simplifying and arranging the terms, we will be having quadratic in a square b square. So let me write the final equation a square b square minus 50ab plus 264. If you will simplify easily you will be getting this equation. Now this is quadratic in ab. Okay. If you want to substitute then you can write ab is equal to 2x so it, or any other variable y. So y square minus 50y plus 264 equal to 0. So let's solve this for AB. So I will write AB is equal to 
let me write that equation once more a square b square minus 50 ab plus 264 equal to 0 minus b so minus 50 so minus of minus plus plus minus the square root 50 square minus 4 times 264 divided by 2a so 2 I will be having 50 plus minus 2500 1056 divided by 2 50 plus minus this value will come out 1 triple 4 over 2 this is a square of 38 so I can write plus minus 38 over 2 because we know that 1 triple 4 square root is 38 so this value will be 88 over 2 or 12 over 2 so AB is about to come either 44 or 6 okay let's consider ab is equal to 6 first and then we will take up ab equal to 44 let's consider ab is equal to 6 first okay so i will write ab is equal to 6 our first equation was a plus b equal to 5 now i am going to use very popular algebraic identity a minus b whole square that is a plus b whole square minus 4 ab okay let's put the value a plus b is 5 so 5 is square minus 4 times 6 25 minus 24 so we are having 1 take a square root both sides so a minus b will come out plus minus 1 all right now see the case of see the case of ab is equal to 44 Again, I will use the same identity. A minus B whole square is equal to A plus B whole square minus 4AB. Again, I will write here 5 square 25 minus 4 times 44 this time. And if you will find out this value, then this value is coming out negative. And this value will be imaginary. Whole square is negative. That means A minus by b is imaginary or complex value so we will reject this a b equal to 44 case all right come back to our original solution a plus b is 5 a minus b is symmetrical equation again plus minus 1 once you will simplify it will be having means y a plus b is equal to 5, a minus b is equal to 1 and then second case you will take a minus b equal to negative 1. So we will frame here again two equation or you can write the one solution and then swap the values. That is the property of symmetric equation. So let me write here a plus b equal to 5, a minus b equal to 1 suppose. Adding both the equations, 2a is equal to 6 a is equal to 3. Once a 3, b will come out because a plus b is 5. So b will come out 2. Symmetrical, so we will swap the value. So either a 3, b 2 or a 2, b 3. Alright. What was a and b? This was a, this was b. So only need to put the values to check the final x value. Okay, let me write here a equal to 3, b equal to 2 and then we will take up a equal to 2, b equal to 3. This is our a, this is our b. Okay, so let me put the value a is equal to 3. In place of a we can write fourth power of equal to 3. So from here we can conclude x is equal to 3 power 4 that means 81. 
from first set of values we can conclude x must be equal to 81 from second set we can write x is equal to a power 4 directly you can put here 2 power 4 so 16 okay from second set we are having 16 now let's verify quickly verification okay x is equal to 81 come to the original one original equation we have to put the values so i will write fourth power of 97 minus 81 plus fourth power of 81 it should come out 5 okay let us check 97 minus 81 is 16 its fourth power plus fourth power of 81 so fourth power of 81 is 3 fourth power of 16 is 2 so yes it is true that means x is equal to 81 is verified and it is correct second value x is equal to 16 so fourth root of 97 minus 16 plus fourth root of 16 so this time it will give us 2 97 minus 16 is 81 81 is 3 power 4 4 4 will be over 3 3 plus 2 is 5 verified so x is equal to 81 and 16 is our final answer and real answer thank you so much for watching do not forget to like share and subscribe friends and bye bye till next video